Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Alex. I'm a real estate investor and today I want to just give you a quick tutorial on how to add a phone number to your REI reply account. So without further ado, let's get into it. So all you're going to do is you're going to go over here to settings. So you're going to come over here to settings way at the bottom. My computer is being very slow because it's also trying to record at the same time. You're going to come to phone numbers. So then you got all your phone numbers here and what you're going to do, add number and add phone numbers. And then you can come and, you know, pick whatever area code you want, right? So I'm going to want, I want a 941 number at the first part of the number. All right. So let's go for Charlotte. Proceed to buy. Awesome. So now we have our phone number. And then the next thing I'm going to want to do is basically set up a user within my REI reply account to be assigned to this phone number. So I'm gonna to wanna to come over here to my staff, add employee, and you can, I think that number was 6564, so I'll just probably name it Alex 6564. And then this just has to be any email at email.com oh email s and then i don't know if this matters or not but when i was going through my rei reply setup they said first save the user i'll do that now and then come here to edit and then they say add add the phone number so oh, where are we at here not user permissions i believe it's call and voicemail settings so this one, then we can assign to that number that we just had bought right here. And you can also set like a timeout too. So um, how long the incoming call comes in for it times out. So I'm, I want no timeout. And then forward calls to mobile app. We want that so that our it rings on our mobile phone when somebody calls this number. And user roles, you know, this person just, it can be a user. Save. All right. So that's going to load up, but that's essentially all you do. You buy the phone number, you create a user to assign to that phone number, and then you can take those users and basically assign those users to different campaigns or workflows to, to text from different numbers. So now you've got all your phone numbers bought and uh, you've assigned them to different users. You've created little profiles for each phone number in your business. What you want to do then to make sure that your campaigns or your workflows are, are text blasting from all these different numbers that you get to utilize, uh, is you want to come in here. So this is your workflow. And after your trigger and before your first text message, you're going to want to assign it to a user. And probably only assign ones that are unassigned already. And then you can come in here and just add all the users and then that you would like. And I know what the new... Um, all the new regulations and stuff like that. I think the general rule of thumb is about 25 text messages, 20 to 25 text messages per hour per number. Um, and then definitely try to keep that under 200 a day and then try not to send the exact same text message over and over. So, um, but this, this is essentially how you do it. So you can come in here, basically add all these users. So now I think I, I don't even, I didn't count, but six or seven users. So, whatever six times 25 is, which is incalculable, 150 or so. Um, so now I can send about 150 text messages per hour. And then you can just scale that up, you know, keep buying more more numbers if you want to send more text messages. Um, and, and yeah, it's pretty simple from there. The, the cool thing about text blasting and text message marketing is it is a very, very just clearly a numbers game and you can easily scale up and down just based on um, how many numbers you have and how many texts per day you send and you can look at the response rate for each text message so that is one reason i'm drawn to text message marketing so beyond that uh, that is how you buy new numbers that's how you create a new a user and assign them that number and that is how you make sure when you're text blasting that it comes from all your different phone numbers right so if you learned something from that or if you enjoyed it drop a like comment what you learned share this with somebody who who might find it useful. And if you want to check out REI Reply, there is a link in the description. Click it, don't click it, doesn't matter to me. Uh, but hopefully you did learn something from this and hopefully this makes your text message marketing a little bit more successful. 
and uh, helps you take one more step down that on that path. So awesome. See you guys on the next one.